The portfolio is not, in our view, concentrated at all. We have investments in retail, banking, uh, other financial services, um, media, transportation. We invest essentially across the whole of the market. We just invest in those companies which are using all of the available tools at their disposal to be able to build better businesses. I often make this, this um, point, which is that all of the tools that Uber uses, and we're not investors in Uber, Uber, but that's not the point. All of the tools that investors, that Uber uses in order to build a better taxi network were available to taxi companies around the world. They elected not to deploy them. And in the process of not electing to deploy them, they left consumers waiting for taxis, not knowing where the taxi was, when it was arriving, and all those things that Uber gives you. Now, there was nothing that stopped uh, the taxi companies globally from thinking this through and pursuing it. They didn't, and history is what history is now, and Uber is where it is. The portfolio is diversified, but the number of stocks we run is around about 20 we can run up to a 35 stock portfolio. We've held more than 22. Uh, at inception, uh, the, the simple proposition is that we would have 16 stocks at 5% at 10 and 10 at 2 to make up 100%. And then from that, we may have slightly more or slightly less stocks. Uh, currently, we are running at sort of 15% cash. Um, so we've got a kind of qu quite high cash weighting because we've been selling into this um, significant, significant uptick that's been going on the last couple of months, uh, having, uh, you know, having bought during the December slowdown because we thought a lot of names had been you know, thrown out at cheap prices.